YouTube playlists are a really easy way for you to save resources or for you to share videos with your students. Um, you need to have a YouTube account set up. You can use your school Gmail or Google account to do that. It's a super easy thing to do. Uh, once you have that, you'll just click on my channel. If you've never done it before, it'll just say, do you want to set this up? And you answer a couple questions. Um, you find your playlist underneath playlists. And you see things like, here's um, some gear ratio videos that I use with my students. I showed them these, so I don't want to have to look for them every year, so I made them into a playlist that sits here. Also, uh, my rocket construction one, the kids would uh, watch how to do part of this. I'd share this uh, playlist with them. They'd watch a video and follow along. Um, so this was something that my kids actually interacted with. I've also seen um, some people use them to share book trailers. So if you have a whole bunch of different videos um, of book trailers, you want your kids to be able to see and pick which book they want. A really easy way to do this. Um, you could also... If you have your students making their own videos, uh, put those into a uh, the final product into a YouTube playlist and have the kids watch each other's videos on Chromebooks. Uh, then you don't have to have everyone in class sit and watch them on the projector. Um, they can kind of go through at their own pace and interact with the videos um, and do those things uh, right on their Chromebooks. Uh, so if you have a video that you would like to put onto a playlist. Um, you'll go here and click on the add to button right here. And let's say I would like to make a new playlist because I don't have one. These are the ones I already have set up. I'm going to make a new one called um, Active Learning. As soon as I hit enter, uh, this is already added to my active learning uh, playlist. So I want to add a different one. I'm going to go here and I'm going to click add to. Now it shows up in my list and I can add another video. Let's say I want to add one more. So I'll click here. I just need to click on add to active learning. Now I've got three videos added to that playlist. If I want to go back to my channel and see them, I can do so and I have my playlist right here um, you can say I have these three videos if I wanted to share this with my students or someone else I could just use this link and put it in Google Classroom or email it to them or however uh, you would like to do that if you have any questions about setting up playlists in YouTube uh, please ask your technology integration specialist